Number 25, the Beale Ciphers. In 1885, a small pamphlet was anonymously published in Virginia containing a story and three encrypted messages. The story claimed that the messages led to a treasure buried by a man named Beale. Only one of the messages was ever solved. Number 24, the Voynich Manuscript. Estimated to be at least 600 years old, this 232-page manuscript is written in some sort of undecipherable language. It features numerous pictures of unidentified plants and people in strange plumbing-like contraptions. Number 23, the Zodiac Killer Ciphers. Between 1966 and 1974, the Zodiac serial killer sent more than 20 encrypted messages to police. Most have been cracked, but a few remain unsolved. Number 22, Cryptos. In 1990, a sculpture with four sections of encrypted characters was installed at CIA headquarters as a challenge to the employees of the agency. Three sections have been decrypted, but a fourth is still not solved. Number 21, the Dora Bella Cipher. In 1897, the well-known composer Edward Elger, of pomp and circumstance fame, sent an encrypted message to a 23-year-old friend, Miss Dora Penny. To this day, it has still not been solved. Number 20, the Degapayev Cipher. Alexander de Gapayev wrote an elementary book on cryptography in 1939 entitled Codes and Ciphers. In the first edition, he included a challenge cipher. It was never solved and even Alexander embarrassedly admitted later that he no longer knew how he'd encrypted it. Number 19, Linear A. In 1990, a large number of clay tablets dating back to 1800 BC were discovered in Crete. They contained two different types of scripts which were named Linear A and Linear B. Linear B was fully deciphered in the 1950s, while Linear A remains unsolved. Number 18. The Phaistos Disc. A circular clay tablet about 6 inches across, it was discovered in Crete in the early 1900s. With an alphabet of 45 different symbols, it has thus far remained uncracked. There have been suggestions, however, that it could help decipher Linear A. Number 17. The Chinese Gold Bar Ciphers. In 1933, seven gold bars were allegedly issued to a General Wang in Shanghai, China. They contained pictures, ancient Chinese writing, some form of script writing, and cryptograms in Latin letters. Number 16. Indus Script The Indus Valley Civilization flourished around 2600 to 1800 BC on the Indian subcontinent, leaving behind thousands of objects inscribed with a pictographic script that seems to have been composed of about 400 signs. A great deal of work has been done on analyzing the messages that are available, but to this date, the script has still not been deciphered. Number 15. Richard Feynman's Challenge Ciphers In 1987, a message was posted to an internet cryptology list saying that Caltech physics professor Richard Feynman was given three samples of code by a fellow scientist at Los Alamos. Only one was ever solved. Number 14. The Enigma Encryption System a popular encryption mechanism used by Germany during World War II, there are still some messages that have yet to be decrypted. Number 13, the Pigeon Cipher. An unsolved World War II message that was found attached to the remains of a pigeon found by a man while he was cleaning out his chimney in Surrey, England. Number 12, Rongo Rongo Script of Easter Island. In 1868, Europeans first reported seeing wooden tablets on the incredibly remote Easter Island in the South Pacific. The tablets were covered with an unknown hieroglyphic script. Only 20 or so tablets are thought to be in existence, with little progress in determining what it is that they say. Number 11. Vincha, or Old European. A collection of symbols found on many of the artifacts dating from between 6000 to 4500 BC excavated from sites in Southeast Europe, in particular from Vincha near Belgrade. There's no agreement on whether these symbols are a writing system. Number 10. Proto-Elamite. A script which first appeared in about 2900 BC in Susa, southwestern Persia. It is yet to be deciphered and the language it represents is unknown. Number 9. Rohonk Codex. Named after the city of Rohonk in what was then Western Hungary, this manuscript written in an unknown language is on display at the Hungarian Science Academy. Number 8. Taman Shud. On December 1, 1948, an unidentified body washed up on a beach in South Australia. He remains unidentified and the only clue was a piece of scrap paper in his pocket that had two words written on it, Taman Shud, which translates to ended in Persian. This was a direct reference to the Rubaiyat of Omar Khayyam, a book that was discovered in the back seat of an unlocked car near the beach where he was found. There were several numeric codes in the car as well, but they were never deciphered. Number 7. McCormick Cipher in 1999, the body of 41-year-old Ricky McCormick was found decomposing in a field in eastern Missouri. He had two cryptic ciphers in his pockets. 
The FBI has asked for the public's help in cracking the code by crowdsourcing a solution over the internet. Number 6. Chaos Cipher While it's not technically unsolved anymore as the algorithm has been released, for numerous years no one could decode the cipher that author J.F. Byrne had published in his autobiography. Number 5. Shugborough Inscription O-U-O-S-V-A-V-V. These letters are carved into a stone monument on the grounds of Shugborough Hall in Staffordshire, England. In spite of much speculation, no one has ever managed to figure out their meaning. Number four, the Navajo Code Talkers. During World War II, the Allies used Navajo Indians for the purposes of encrypted communication. Navajo is one of the most notoriously hard to learn languages on Earth with sounds that are uncommon to many other languages. Furthermore, the language itself used code words which made it hard even for native speakers to understand. It was never broken and played a crucial role in the Allied victory. Number 3. The Blitz Ciphers Discovered during World War II in a bombed cellar in East London, they showed about 50 symbols each. Some speculate that they could be 18th century Freemason ciphers. Number 2. Belasso Ciphers the 16th century Italian cryptologist was responsible for many techniques still used today, and several of his challenge ciphers have yet to be decrypted. And number one, the Bacon Cipher. Sir Francis Bacon was well known for creating and using what is now known as the Bacon Cipher in his literary works. For the last several hundred years, there has been speculation that Sir Bacon was in fact responsible for writing the works of Shakespeare, and that his cipher might be found throughout the text. As of yet, there has been no conclusion on the matter. If you liked the video you just saw, then consider clicking on the button at the top right to subscribe. Also, check out our other popular videos, 25 Most Bizarre and Somewhat Ironic Ways to Die, and 25 Most Indestructible Things Known to Man. If you're still itching for more, go ahead and check out our website at list25.com for a whole bunch of cool lists.